Okay, what's up guys? So, it's awesome to be back on the Tuscan Landscaping channel. It is February 2023 and I got a whole series for you that starts all the way back in uh, March 2021. Wow, I can't believe how fast time goes. But I am standing here in my own backyard. You know the old adage of um, a shoe cobbler's kids never have any shoes. Wow, the same goes true for landscapers. My wife and I bought this place uh, about a year and a half after we got back from Romania, and it was a dump. Like it was, if I'd had more money, I'd have just pushed it all over, but I didn't. So my brothers and I, and some kind uncles and my dad, we all worked together and we gutted the whole place and ended up remodeling it. But we never had a dining room or it was, it was pretty small. We didn't, comp we didn't really do anything to the outside. Well, the roof started leaking and you know the whole give a mouse a cookie story. So we're like, well, let's get a price on the roof. Well, we're gonna do that. We may as well do the siding too. It was pretty rough. Probably was 50 years old. If we're gonna get into that level of project, we may as well just add like a little bump out for a dining room uh, where the old like lean to porch was. And we're like, well, then that was like eight by 10 and it kept growing and it kept growing until it turned into this whole entire addition. And then it got to be like, well, that's, let's not do that. Let's not put the dining room in the nice new section with big windows. Let's make that the living room. Suffice to say, we ended up getting into an entire remodeling project and we added on a room to the house, redid the entire exterior, and then the entire backyard was decimated. And so the wheels started turning. We ended up doing an entire project in my own backyard and the shoe cobbler's kids got some shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna do a whole series here. Ben helped me a lot doing this backyard. My brothers helped me, but it was an entire, like the whole thing was nights and weekends. Like I was still working full time and, and synced up. We pretty much worked nights and weekends from March, 2021 until Labor Day weekend is when we blew Hydra Seed in the backyard here. I'm gonna take you on a bit of a series and show you the whole story of how I put it together. Now mind you, the fact that I did it all myself with some help from friends and Ben and that kind of thing, nights and weekends meant that the video footage could have been better. It, like, the, it made the editor, thanks for your work, Clayton, made the editor work really hard in getting a, a chronological story put together. But I'm gonna piece it together with a narrative. So right now we're gonna go back to midsummer 2021 when the materials were showing up. So let's cue the uh, arrival of the materials. Big day! Woohoo! <laughs> Putting on a show. <laughs> Look at that. I was anxious. I never actually got to see this product in person before I ordered it, so I was kinda okay. I was kinda holding my breath a little bit, but that's beautiful. Very nice. Guess we'll see what it looks like on the ground. So yeah, a couple of things that are a little unusual about this video. One, it's Unilock, that's a first. I'm gonna give that a shot. And two, it's at her house. Whoa! Which also means they're gonna pay for this. <laughs> get done today. We got trucks coming in everywhere. Trucks and trucks and trucks. Morning, Tony. Hey, morning. Boy, this is a happening place this morning. Yeah. <laughs> Do you need a coffee to relieve some stress? Yeah, that would be good. Okay, yeah. we'll yeah. get you we'll get you rolling. Yeah. What do we got? We have a showdown between uh, two uh, warriors here. Look at this. Are we gonna have a knockdown drag out in the middle of the road? Did you bring your six shooter? <laughs> oh, 
Okay, so let's head back to March 2021 when the house construction had pretty much just been wrapped up and we were still working on regrading the entire like land around the new addition, beginning to get our base work in. In today's video, we're gonna kind of show you the, the, the bare bones, like the beginning, the, the canvas that we had to work with as we started. I'm gonna show you then a video on kind of on the retaining walls, the paver patio and the sidewalk themselves, this kind of paver art thing that we cut, this design that we cut in to the backyard. And of course, I'm gonna show you the outdoor kitchen. We've got some gas features going on here with some nice torches. So I'm gonna show you all that stuff, each in its own like step by step video. So grab your favorite snacks, hit that subscribe button so you can jump along for the ride and let's go look what it looks like when a landscaper does a project in his own backyard. Okay, just made it back from the first Lowe's run to get some uh, sweeps for this conduit and some fittings and stuff. Ben was working on getting all of these downspouts worked in like they need to be. Right there's one. I'm working on these over here from this little roof. And Steve just showed up with the equipment. Steve is such a good guy. I'm telling you. He's coming over here on a Saturday, leaving all his projects. Let's bring some equipment. Sorry guys, I forgot to video this. But there, we just got the first boulder in place, which is gonna hold this grade back. There you go. Chase, okay, back up a little bit. So, Ben, if this boulder, I might want to kick this, pick this corner up like two, three inches right here. Once we got it leveled up, we'll just, we can slide this, this corner back about four or five inches. Then it's perfect. There you go. There you go. Yep. Keep going. No, oh, 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 that's good. Pick that up again. Show us some more from there and back into there. There you go. Good. Perfect. May as well just take that out of the bowl and just pop it right in here. Hi. You want to say hi to the camera? I already did. Okay. Tell everybody to subscribe to Tussie Landscaping. No, you do. No. Here, just go like this. Subscribe. No, I don't want to. Say, click the like button. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of this whole project, Chase? Good. No, I like you, it. You like it? Yeah. Okay. What's your favorite part? The activator. Why? Because. <laughs> What's Ben doing over there? He's taking the dirt. Is he working for chicken wings? <laughs> no! Oh, it's lunchtime soon. I know. <laughs> I'm working over here on getting these conduit sealed in place with this putty so we don't get any water issues in there. After lunch, equipment is running again. Chuck is hauling dirt. Let's go. I'm gonna get prepping here to run these drain lines for the spouting here. Looks like you still got some hot wing sauce there. Here. Yeah. Okay, fabric is in and first stone is going in. Woohoo! So we've now got the canvas kind of set, all the excavations are kind of cut in, and we're putting in all our base rock and drainage lines and all that to kind of prepare for the beauty that's about to take place. Make sure you're subscribed and tap that notification bell and hit that like button so you can follow along for this whole entire series. <laughs> 